Uh, Luke Hodge. I'd never tell him that though. Yeah, probably Luke Hodge. Hate to say it, but it's probably Luke Hodge. <laughs> um, yeah, can't really think of anyone else too sort of exciting or, um, I don't know, four-time Premiership player, two-time Norm Smith. Let's everyone know about it. He's a uh, pretty, uh, pretty special guy. I've seen a lot of uh, um, mates with Matty Poole, the, uh, the Iron Man, and I know he's, his missus is he's quite famous, so I'm going to throw Pooley up as a bit of a, bit of a curveball. Um, probably most recently would be the King Kyrgios. Uh, I actually caught him up on the podcast the other day and I had to get his number, so um, that's what we did with him and he's, uh, he's, he's pretty cool. I don't mind him, so. Uh, I'd probably have to give it to the Brownlow medalist, Lockie Neal. Pretty well, Lockie Neal, I reckon. <laughs> Charlie Cameron, he tells me every day. Uh, I'm not sure, I think Greg Inglis, because um, he was my fa idol growing up, so I think that's probably my favourite. Oh, contact and famous person and contact list, yeah, probably Greg Inglis. Mitch Robinson, I don't have too many people in my contacts list, but yeah, Mitch Robbo, I think he's got the most Insta followers, or Charlie, or something like that. Robbo would probably think he's the, the most famous, the way he's going at the moment, so i probably have to say him. A UFC fighter, a lady called Yuani Andrejcik, who um, we actually kept in contact when I saw her in the UFC one, so she's probably the most famous, but um, yeah, most people wouldn't really know her, so I don't think that counts. <laughs>